Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and I know, I know before you say, Josh, you have been gone for so long, what the heck, didn't you say that like a long time ago that you were going to be back and you're going to get with it and then you're going to post uh, more and more and more, but here we are, I think it's been like a month <laughs> since I last posted and I know it's been a while guys, I stopped on you know, and I like, and took a break from doing YouTube, mainly because I wanted to finish the semester off strong in college, and I fell flat. And then I came back home, which is like, now you can see I am back home right now. I am not in the usual setup with my tapestry in the background. I have uh, Goku from Dragon Ball Z um, and SpongeBob. Uh, they will accompany me in this video. But <laughs> um, yeah, but I wanted to make one last video of. 2019. Can you guys believe it? It's uh, 2019 is about to be over and done with, and it's freaking crazy to me. I feel like this year just like went by so fast, but it's so slow. Like, does anybody else feel that way? Like, especially you know this semester, it's been like a very hard semester for me, especially like academically and like with work and all this stuff. It's been a lot. Um, and then there's a certain points that I didn't think I could handle it, but you know. Um, at times it felt really fast because I was like, holy crap, like, it's December now. But then at other times it's like, wow, this is going so slow. But, never mind all of that, I'm so glad I am making another video before 2019 ends. So in this video, you know, Christmas just, you know, ended. Uh, if you don't celebrate Christmas, maybe you celebrate Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, whatever you may celebrate. All good. We love diversity. Um, but for me, I celebrate Christmas and, you know, when... Christmas happens, presents happens. So, uh, for some reason, I like to watch the videos where, like, I see what other people got. I don't know why. It's just like, just like a downtime. Like, I like seeing that um, during the holiday season, and then they get so much joy out of what they got. So, I want to do the same on my channel. And um, of course, this will be the last like video of 2019. So, I wanted to do this. And um, yeah, so let's get started. So, I'm gonna start with some presents my uncle got me um it's really really cute he got me this gray blanket it's super soft of course it's fleece um it's really good it's like really plush it's really chic um yeah i really love like a great moment <laughs> it's so funny he came up to me and he was like gray or blue he just came up to me and said and i'm like what for and he said gray or blue and i'm like i don't know what for he's like gray or blue so i picked gray and it turned out to be a blanket so it was really cool and i really like it it's super soft um another thing he got me was these two scarves the first one is a i i think this is called a blanket scarf uh it's like a square scarf does it keep moving yeah it's like a square scarf um you know i Never really wore scarves before, but I wanted to get into it, so I'm so happy that I got some scarves this year. And yeah, it's super cool. It has like fringes all around the sides. Um, it's like a what do you call this? Oh, like a not flannel plaid. It's like a plaid pattern kind of, and it'll be like super cute, especially with this like sweater or like maybe kind of some kind of solid color, uh, so solid like sweater or maybe a solid shirt. And I already like try to learn some techniques with. Um, you know, scarf, like, you know, like how I wear a scarf and stuff like that. So if you ever got, guys want to see like the techniques I learned, let me know down below in the comments. But, um, yeah, I really love it and I can't wait to start using it. But I live in Florida, so it's kind of hot here. Uh, so it'll be a rare moment that I actually get to wear these. Um, but let's see. The second scarf he got me was, <laughs> I find this funny because he got me, it says Louis Vuitton. Um, I can't find the words, but it's like a Louis Vuitton scarf. Is it from like actual Louis Vuitton? Don't know about that. But yeah, so it's Louis Vuitton. Um, it has the circles right here. Um, has like the pattern of Louis Vuitton. Yeah, I find it super cute. It even has the word somewhere, but oh, it's right here. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it says Louis Vuitton right there. Um, I don't know if you guys can, but yeah, it's pretty cute. I gotta figure out, uh, how to style this but i think i have some ideas so hopefully hopefully i come up with something um so that's it for my uncle so let's put this all to the side because i have some stuff here <laughs> um oh i do want to shout out 
my best friend Sarah, she has been in my video and she did get me some presents about, um, it was when I was, you know, back in, you know, my college and she, we exchanged presents so I do not have a present with me as of right now, but I do want to include it in this video and she got me this uh, leather moto jacket which I love her for. It was so cute, so chic and I, she knew I wanted a jacket like that and I actually pointed out that jacket in a specific store we shop at. H&M, hashtag not sponsored. <laughs> but I love this jacket so much and she got me this Goodfellow Target sunglasses. It's black and um, yeah, I love her. I love her so much. And yeah, so I wanted to um, let her know how much that I appreciate her gifts to me and I hope she likes the gifts I got her. Um, so moving on. Oh, also, another thing. I actually met Sarah's family because my baby graduated from college this semester and it's super sad but I love her and I know she's gonna do great things in life and I met her family and they and her mom and her stepdad actually got me um, a gift card to Starbucks I know this I love Starbucks so thank you so much <laughs> um, but yeah so I wanted to include them here because they got me that and I am so appreciative of that um, so another best friend of mine, we went to college together, but we also went to middle school and high school together. So I've known her for so long, like nine years and counting. It's insane. But um, yeah, I love her. She's my ride or die. And so is Sarah. But, um, but yeah, she's my ride or die. You haven't seen her in any video. Hopefully you see her eventually. <laughs> but um, yeah, she got me some gifts too. She actually got me this little, uh, I don't know, what did I call this? A little like plush clip that's what they call it a jughead plush clip that's what you know a little science test <laughs> um but if you don't know who jughead is it's from this show called riverdale um yeah and it, he's like this little you know he's part of a gang it's supposed to be this really like you know bad boy kind of vibe um even in the back it says south side serpents i don't know if you see that um but yeah i think it's really cool um yeah, and I really like it. He has a, a beanie, a little, you know, leather jacket moment. It's like his usual ghetto. Another thing she got me, if you didn't know already, I love Dragon Ball Z. It was my favorite. It's not was. Let me reiterate. It is my favorite anime. I love Dragon Ball Z. I loved it when I was a child. So I love it today. It's a special place in my heart. And um, my, uh, my best friend actually knows that about me. And she actually got me um, this case of Dragon Balls inside. So it says Dragon Ball Z right there. Um, it says Dragon Ball Z Crystal Ball. The rest is in Japanese. Um, but yeah, it even has Vegeta. Um, when I turn the box, it has Shenron on the other side. Uh, if you keep going, it has Gogeta. And then it even has the Dragon Balls in the front. So I think it's super cool. Um, so let me do a little unboxing for you guys. So, hope you guys see this. <laughs> but if we open up the box, right? Um, of course, a little bubble wrap. I want to keep it secure. And there's even this letter inside. Inside. Um, it has her name on it, so I won't say it. Uh, I never asked her if she, it was okay to send her name on it. But, uh, so I'm just gonna blank that out. But it says, a gift for you. Merry Christmas, bitch, from, like, best friend, um, which is her name. And uh, I'm super appreciative of this. This is so, so cute. And it actually has little Dragon Balls inside. If you guys could see it right there. Uh, all seven of them. Um, I'll even take one out for you if you can see it right here. Um, but yeah, I find it super cute. If you didn't know what this is, Goku in the Dragon Ball series called this uh, his grandfather. It's a whole thing. Uh, if you don't know what that means, go watch the anime. Um, but yeah, she got me that, and she also, if I could find it, got me this. Okay, so here's, here's the thing, guys. I am really good with spices. I love spicy food. Uh, I think spicy food is so yum, yum, yum. But there's to an extent of that spicy food, and my best friend um, tends to get me things to, make, uh, to see if I could take it. And she decided to get me this Little Nitro, the world's hottest gummy bear. Um, if you can see already, he's a little bit eaten, uh, but that's okay. Uh, I said he, we don't know this gender. We don't, we don't get genders around here. So, um, 
But yeah, it's a little gummy bear right here. Uh, it's red. And this bitch was hot. So apparently, uh, this little gummy bear is 900 times hotter than a jalapeno pepper. This little shit is hot. So if you ever want to get a little nitro, just know it's hot, especially for your friends that you want to challenge them with spicy uh, stuff. Uh, it was a good time though, and I appreciate her for that. It was super fun, especially having my family try it. Uh, hilarious. So just a little idea um, if you want to do that. Oh, my parents uh, also got me a Christmas present and they got me this, uh, this ear, okay rude. Uh, they got me this earring set of sterling silver um, earrings and I really always wanted sterling silver earrings. Uh, I'll let you guys see it right now. I'm actually, you see like there's two missing. I'm actually wearing them right now. I don't know if you can see it um right there but yeah i absolutely love this it's super cute super chic um it's very stylish and i wanted to do this for a while i wanted to do like a string sort of earring here here and also i wanted to do like a dangling earring here but i have no idea what to get so if you know of a place that I, uh, you know does good dangling earrings uh just let me know in the comments below because I need help with that and I don't know what to get. I was maybe think of an angel wing. I have no idea. So let's see about that. Also, I forgot something that I had. Uh, we are not shocked about that. But um, my best friend, uh, not Sarah, my other best friend, her parents actually got me something as well. And it's actually, it's a gift card to Taco Bell, which is in this, uh, in this little cute little card. And I'm super appreciative of this because I love Taco Bell so freaking much. Um, yeah, I love Taco Bell, like, and it is known from a lot of my friends and family that I am obsessed. I love it so much. And they also literally, I don't know how long ago they made this, but they made like this blue raspberry freeze and I have not tried it. And I'm so, so excited. And then there's like this other one, it's called like electric blue raspberry. I don't remember if it was lemonade in it or not, but that sounds literally so good straight gas and i want to try it uh and i'm super excited about that another thing they got me was this scarf right here it's super long so i'm not gonna be able to get it in frame but yeah it's this scarf it has like a flannel pattern in the front and the back is this little i don't know if it's plaid like a small like uh flat checkerboard kind of feel in the uh in the other side and it's super cute and i you know a lot of styles um that i could do with this flannel so again if you want a video of uh how to style like a like a like a scarf so okay <laughs> uh so my brother my older brother got me uh, a few gifts as well, and I needed a little backstory before I show you these things. So my brother, um, last year, I decided to, you know, it was like a gag gift, but it was his actual gift. It was super funny, but you know, for a while he was having trouble dating, and you know, he always like told me, it was like, Josh, like, I don't know what to do. Like, I'm super nervous when it comes to girls and whatnot. And I'm like, you know, let me get you something that will accompany you at times that you need it. So I did. So I got him, this is so not child friendly, this pocket pussy. <laughs> um, and it was like a legit pocket pussy. And I also got him a toy cleaner. I got him lube, you know, for other occasions as well, whatever he ch uh, so chooses. And um, what else I got him? Oh, and to set the mood, I got him this scented candle i think it was a little bit coconutty i don't remember but yeah i even got him a scented candle and he still has not opened that scented candle a year later uh so you already know he heard from me about that but that's okay uh but this year he decided to get back at me and um oh my god okay i'm only gonna try to show the face because i'm really not but he got me <laughs> i'm gonna put it right here <laughs> this Okay, it's a blow-up doll, y'all. Her name is Judy, and um, yeah, I don't want to get demonetized. So he actually literally got me a blow-up doll, uh, and um, it was a guy gift, of course. And you know, 
Sorry, Judy, but your boy's gay, so figure that out. But maybe you can find like a Henry or some shit. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, not interested. But I thought it was so funny. When I opened it up, she was like in this bag. It was like a guy gift from like Amazon or something. Um, it was so funny. Really not gonna use it. No, <laughs> no thank you. But on a real note though, he also got me this game called Horizon Zero Dawn, the complete edition. I have no idea um, how good this game is. I heard it's really good and I can't wait to try it. So I'm super excited to try it. I actually was gonna buy it for myself for Black Friday, but then I decided not to because I have like several games that I have literally started playing and I'm not beating them and I should get, you know, on that. But I told him that I was gonna get this game and he decided to get it for me. So that saves me money and I am appreciative of that. And hopefully I will be open this because it is new and I will actually beat it. Um, maybe in 2020, who knows? But yeah, so that is it in terms of Christmas presents that people got me. But for me, you know, I decided to uh, give me a few things as well. So I got myself these Nike shoes. I think they're super chic, super cute. And I got these Sperry's that are coming in. Uh, they have not been delivered. Um, I also got this new Fitbit watch because Apple watches are too expensive for my taste. Um, what else did I get? Was that it? I feel like I'm missing something. No, that's it. I got that for me, but let's not forget that about a, a little bit over a month ago, I did go to the Ariana Grande concert, so that was also a present for me for this holiday season. And oh, I could go on by Ariana Grande, but like that's not the point of the video. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was definitely a highlight of the 2019 season. But with that notion, that is it in terms of presents altogether. And you know, to everyone who got me presents, uh, or like I said, Merry Christmas or whatnot, thank you so much for all they do. And I love every single one of you guys and all of these presents to me um and to all of you guys out there i hope you had a ha uh, happy holidays merry christmas happy kwanzaa um, happy hanukkah all that good stuff i hope you had a great time with family friends uh, loved ones significant others all that good stuff and yeah so i hope you had an incredible 2019 and here's to an incredible 2020 so um of course y'all happy new year um and with that notion if you like this video please hit the thumbs up down below and turn on my post notifications so you can stay with me on this journey and you can see every time I post, even in 2020, y'all. Um, come below, anything you want. It's an open forum, why not? Uh, let's talk down below. Uh, if you wanna keep following me on my journey, uh, you can follow me on social media, on my Instagram and my Twitter. It's just underscore Joshua Barreto. That is J-O-S-H-U-A-B-A-R-R-E-T-O. -E no caps and no spaces. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Again, here's to 2020, y'all. Let's have a good year. And I'll see you next time. All right, bye.